fentanyl deaths are a major problem in L.A. County, and the health department is teaming up with local libraries to help. Narcan, or Naxalone, is the medicine that quickly reverses an opioid overdose. And now, people who live in L.A. can get free Narcan kits along with training on how to administer them. L.A. County Library Director Sky Patrick is joining us live with more on this program. Thank you so much for being with us. Um, this is such an important topic. I have people in my life, I think people um, can sometimes use a stigma to believe who they think these people are, but I've lost uh, uh, family and friends to opioid addiction. These training clinics, uh, it turns out, are being held on Wednesdays. Anybody can access them, which I think is super important. What do people need to do if they want to take part in this program? Well, first of all, thank you for having us. Uh, we are the LA County Library, and um, it's actually quite simple. People can just go to the desk at the 10 locations currently and ask for naloxone. There are no questions asked. There's not an age limit or age requirement, I should say. Uh, you have to read a short document, and if you choose, watch a short video on how to administer, and then you take your uh, you take your kit home. Each kit has two doses, and we don't ask any questions. We're really just here trying to provide a service and provide support. I'm somebody who does now carry these with me uh, as well because it is such a you know a hot topic here in LA specifically. How did you decide which libraries uh, libraries this would be at and be available? Well, that's a great question. We worked with the Department of Public Health here in the county to determine the areas of the county that of the highest need. You know, we saw a 1,600% increase in naloxone overdoses. So we have the data to support the libraries that we initially launched. And then, of course, as you know, we've expanded. Now we have 10 locations providing these clinics uh, starting, um, starting back in November. So we work with public health. We try to distribute it around the county, different areas of different cities. As you know, there are 88 cities here. We have library support in 49 of those cities, and then, of course, all the unincorporated. So we tried to be very equitable where we uh, located this uh, service. How was li library staff trained to help in these cases? Sure. We worked with and partnered with the Department of Public Health, the local Department of Public Health, under, under the leadership of Dr. Ferrer, Barbara Ferrer. Um, and we trained, we allowed staff to volunteer, first of all, so that the the onerous was not on the team, but people who wanted to be as prepared as possible. All 86 of our libraries have naloxone or Narcan, Narcan at our locations in case we have an overdose. And then we vol had staff volunteer. So we have about half of our staff who volunteered to be trained to administer uh, the support. And they'll be training then people who come in. Can you talk about the training is not difficult. It's actually pretty simple. It's not difficult at all. In fact, you have to read a one page document. Um, and then if you choose, we have a video that you can watch is on a supported by an iPad um, on how to administer. And then that's it. It literally takes three to four minutes. Yeah, it's very simple and it can save so many lives. Sky, thank you so much for being with us. We appreciate it. Sure. Thank you. so much. For more information on the library clinics themselves, including dates, check out our website, kcalnews.com and click scene on TV.